So T Dog in a slap fight, uh, who would win? <laughs> Tom Cruise or Kurt Warner? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Man. Man. Come on, well. put the camera on yourself. <laughs> Gee, that is a tough one. Yeah, Warner would throw a football at him and Let's see, get Warner. the first uh, shot in. And, but Cruz would, so Cruz would take a hit to the face, but he'd be like, you know, he's got all this training for Let's movies. Let's see, Warner is a, so he'd be like, not a Cruz tiny kick, Hollywood, Cruz kick Hollywood Chris person. Carroll's ass. Come yeah. on. Cruz, Cruz would win. Cruz would, Cruz would be cool. like, no, Cruz would Cruz not. You think Cruz really would game. win? <laughs> They'd have a catwalk showdown. <laughs> see who can <laughs> no. sashay. Wrong. Yeah, yeah, Warner has God on his side. <laughs> That's right. I forgot. I didn't factor God into the equation. <laughs> but Cruz is uh, Scientologist. Scientologist. Yeah, he's Scientologist. Yeah. 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 Fuck, how yeah. can a lady exactly. here, are you a Scientologist? Yeah. I'm That's an so atheist. That's fucking uh, Travolta, Doesn't too. that mean you're going to burn in hell? Yeah, you're right. Didn't you ever no. read L. Ron Hubbard? I'd rather burn in hell than anything else. Magnetics. Oh, really? Even like 18 virgins in heaven? I'd rather burn in hell than I think I like the 18 I'd virgins in heaven. I'd love to go to heaven. Really? Uh-uh. Sorry. I don't know, do you get to choose? Like the flame. Come on, the Orthodox Greeks burn. are the worst on the planet. I know, you what like if, the flame better what than if, the virgins. What if heaven is, is your, is, uh, offers you the ability to hold your babies, the babies you've had, two babies now, right? Two babies. <laughs> it allows you to hold them, like, eternally, just, <laughs> just like, happily and no, you're really forever. No. <laughs> You'd rather have the flame on the ass than hold your babies in heaven. What if you got to have that pinnacle I gave the baby thing. It's over. I gave them the best years of my life. I'm wondering, those were the best years of your life? If you um, if you abort children, are you reunited with them in heaven? What? Isn't it If you abort the children, are you reunited with them in heaven? I don't know, man. What do you think? I don't. I don't know. I'm not the. I don't know. Hey, so when's the last time you got laid? I had what? The last time you got laid. When was that? Oh, that was early January. Okay, Lupe. Who was it? Last time you got laid. When was it? Who was it? Your son? Does <laughs> <laughs> that go for you too, babe? God, no! Yeah, I wouldn't call you're it getting laid so much as getting anally no. raped by the pricey clan. Why did you name your son Lupe? Lupe. Lupe. What, so when was the last time? That was like a month ago. I'm still All right. sore. All right. <laughs> I'm still Joe? Funny. Last time you got laid? <laughs> it would be last night. Okay. Well, there was Saturday at Tim's, which is like the man thing. <laughs> the man. Sunday, so, so, so. Bob I did the wife service thing, so like yesterday. The wife Bob service? Are you sure you want? Bob are you sure you want to characterize it as wife she service? Knows, she knows. Oh, she knows. <laughs> it's so good you can call it whatever you want. Yeah. Plus, plus this ain't shown in Minnesota, thank God. <laughs> Now yeah, my mother's food? making sure it never. I she's on the cable commission. Food? This isn't coming to Minnesota. <laughs> <rape. That was laughs> so Lupe was doing the raping fun. Saturday night. I missed the party. No, no. Yeah, Saturday. No, no. The first, no, no. I watched. Wow. The first three. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> no. It's not mine. When were oh, you yes. last time? Yeah. I'm asking the questions, not answering. Yeah. Oh no no no! You got to answer. Actually, and I'm asking where that. Oh no! Don't delay. Friday. Not Friday. Oh, and Saturday. No, oh, I wasn't Saturday. at the poker game, so not, I, not I missed out on the bad thing. Not Sunday? Yeah, we have a definite no. Oh, game I know, you rest on Sunday. No, You're a Christian, right? right? Yeah, I rest, I rest on Sunday. That's it. I got a hole in the back. Yeah, what's that? I got a missing button and I got a hole in the back. T-Dog, you could transition. Oh, yeah, your button's at my place, dude. <laughs> you know, I mean, I try it during, uh, Mr. during the guts. <laughs> the button assassin. During the guts yeah. game, we're trying to lay the dime, and the D Dog is going, uh, Wait, behind this fucking dime. Uh, no, he retracted the dime. What? Basketball? Syracuse is playing. Well, I think I'm 
gonna go off after I uh, go leave after this year. Yeah, I'm gonna, gonna go, go off after you go. <laughs> <laughs> Get off. That's oh, a, that's a, Jacob? No, no. That's no. bold talk. Get off. <laughs> you didn't just keep going. No. You're just gonna keep driving until you fucking die. Yeah, I wish in, I could. In Montana. But the thing is this. Death does not come when you wish it. You see? And I refuse to commit suicide. <laughs> what did he say? I said, don't I know it. <laughs> Get out, baby. In the house. I was just thinking of the shower. If I just died in the shower, oh, that would be nice. cool. <laughs> That'd be cool. So, a sentiment that our viewers can understand as well. I thought our the cool thing about dying viewer. in the shower is that the tub would overflow into the apartment below, and then find me within a half hour. It would be like rotting away. Yeah, like, exactly. oh, Wow, I like the roast that was Because this fucking toy, this tub is terrible. It like fills up with water. By the time I'm done with the fucking shower, the water's up to like my calf or whatever, you know. It's a cold neck tub. It's a cold neck tub. Must be daddy falling his ass. He could be plugging up the fucking water. Hey, exactly. I know, motherfucker. Hey, could you imagine being uh, the like, uh, rescue person that comes to the T-Dog going, oh, man. <laughs> Dude, are you dead? <laughs> I wouldn't answer. I'd be like, no fucking you wouldn't answer. <laughs> I, would, I would refuse to answer. <laughs> They're slipping on the slip board magazines. <laughs> yeah, that thing is, it's a cramped oh. kind of tub, so I would just fucking fill that fucker. And it can't. It would be, it would overflow. It's a storm. Let's speak for yourself, I, I think I'm politically correct. I think, you're holding the fucking camera. I think Lupe yeah. is politically correct. <laughs> I think it's I would have bet on Kansas. You didn't, you didn't that. even answer. That's political correctness. I'm, a, I'm impressed by how certain What the hell is that? Yeah, I haven't seen the game at all. Facials. Don't watch the club at that. What are you doing, babe? Making facials. Oh. Neither one of these. Hey, uh, Lenny. How yeah. come Greece doesn't have any kind of decent <laughs> It's got soccer. Yeah, but they suck. My, my, my we are coming with a mighty force to Fox News. <laughs> Fox News, just if everyone, you know, I take one day, David Bloom every, over every fuck on Fox News. I wish they would all just die today. I never want to give a shit about one way or another. In fact, in the, in the studio, he's just running out the wrong line. All right. I wish I wasn't filming because Woo! I didn't talk. I'll sum up the whole Iraqi war coverage in yeah. two seconds for our viewers. I'm sure you <laughs> you, forgot, okay. you forgot the bang bang. Bang bang, yabba dabba doo. Who is doing what? Who is doing what? Who's doing what? Yeah. Well, this was me acting as if I was holding my dick. Uh, yes, I know. You know what? But you were jerking off to it, implying that you guys yeah. can jerk yeah. off to is that? It? Like that excites you? No, it is. It, it is all masturbating. Ooh, top it's all, gun. We're all okay, jerking off. They're, they're, they're masturbating, they're masturbating us. No, they're yeah. masturbating I, I think themselves. I and themselves. Right? Babe. And some viewers. Babe, yeah. is it more or and, less exciting uh, than, say, Top Gun? Uh, <laughs> Three and get oh, Never heard that before. Yeah, come on. Dilly, how'd you like Titanic? Titanic, yeah. Fuck it. Geologically. Oh, <laughs> Geologically insignificant. You can do oh, a Marx's plus event. Film, the the actual event and, and like the movie both. Bam. <laughs> <laughs> Superficial. <laughs> in a very scientific sense. It'd be, it'd be a bizarro <laughs> situation to ever find <laughs> right. that fucking boat. <laughs> You missed the whole point. Yeah. You mean like in a million years or so? Oh, yeah. yeah, 15 or 5. Two, Thank you. Well, yeah. guys, I paid so for two shit, sections okay. of these. Yeah. You're the man. It's fucked up. You're on. Awesome. Yeah. my beer. Yeah. So, so shall I give you an I don't give a shit. No, yeah, give us. That's more than we deserve. So but, 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 you know, not everybody's Leonardo <laughs> DiCaprio. Yeah, shipwrecks as a fossil record. You owe me some money. You owe me some money. I do. Yes, you do. What? Don't give me a good television. Yeah. Find out if a shipwreck as a fossil record would be. Yeah. What was it for? Titanic. That's pretty impressive shit. If it was Titanic, it would be pretty cool. Yeah. As opposed to, say, the Nelly Bell. 
Yeah, I believe the belly belt don't go down. That's right. That's right. 200, 300 million years from now, the belly belt still float seaworthy. It's there. It's in that museum with my 68 Dodge Dart. Yeah. It's okay. Bowling alley. Yeah. With the love bowling alley. There you go. The love bowling alley. Even as a kid, I couldn't handle the love you know, It was just <laughs> too much, you know. American bowling alley. <laughs> the only one in America. What happened to you guys? I cannot point to anything that constitutes time. You know, I, I find it very funny to look at a watch and go, it's 25 past three. I, I have absolutely no idea what that means. I have no idea what that means. Or today is um, Thursday. What the fuck is, does that mean, you know? six million years there'll be nothing but dust anyway this incredible miracle that man is in this uh, in this vehicle that we're traveling on is going at this tremendous speed through the through the galaxies you know, uh, as we see the hubble telescope showing us the fiery existence that's around us way out there our past or whatever or our future it's uh, you know, when we talk about miracles we are a miracle we're all living in miracle here. I play all these monsters. So uh, in the old days when I was in my drugs and alcohol days, I would try to satisfy them with whatever role they wanted to see, you know what I mean? Which is uh, not only harmful to me and them and everyone around me, but just not a way to go through life. Uh. You might sometimes have to wear a mask of smiling. You know, at least people see you. They see the outside, smiling. They're all happy. And inside, we're angry. But we can slowly control the inside to make it match the outside. Men, particularly, do have a problem about being perceived as who they are by what they are. So the classic chairman of the company, the one he retires, dies because no one you know, no, he's not the chairman anymore, he's just an ordinary person. If I want to go, you know, dress like a girl, I'm going to dress like a girl, that's just my opinion. It takes tremendous discipline to be a free spirit. To be an artist is something else. It's like, ah, throw away all this, and I want to get in touch with my nature. What is real choice? Big man. Six foot, six and a half foot. And when you bring them to the real den and drop their mask and see the beauty inside, they just cry like babies. It's like only four hours, darling. Four hours to be a woman. And I tell you, we move a fuck up with anybody else. We play. We know how to make the boys happy. You know? They don't care if you have wigs, tits, but have a hairy chest, darling. They love it. Don't try shave. They love it. You know, God created the man to woman. The devil come out, create both of us together. Is there a way? Any thoughts about the end of educated bowlers? Well, no. Yeah. <laughs> I, um... Everybody, a firm no. <laughs> I, I think it was uh, a good show. It had a good run, you know. I'm would proud you call that it, I was would you call it a, it. Would you go so far as to call it a noble experiment? No. No, okay. Well, maybe. For Marshall, <laughs> maybe. I don't really know, though. For Marshall, Once yeah. it comes out on DVD, <laughs> that's when it'll start to... <laughs> that's right. ...more of an impact. <laughs> But so many people nowadays are not watching Channel 8, and I don't blame them. <laughs> no, because all the shows on Channel 8, aside from ours, are shit. Exactly. Complete shit. <laughs> you notice, too, that all the shows on Channel 8, ours is the only one that Billy is on. <laughs> well, he's on no other Channel 8 shows at all. <laughs> Am I wrong? No, you're not wrong. I think that will be it. We, we, we discovered Delhi. That's going to be our claim to fame. We should keep the show next year and do it more of a kind of a... Focus more on Dilly and his theories about government and you know, <laughs> you know, evolution. 
Do you have a bunch of today with Tom Do you have a bunch of old tapes? Because we could do one of those things where like I remember that episode more like this and kind of back. Yeah, I remember it as if it was just yesterday. I remember my first episode of Educated Bowlers. We were at the uh, Wooden Nickel. I was gonna say I remember my before before they kicked us out permanently. And uh, no, they didn't kick us out. Well, whatever they did, I know we don't go there anymore. So. They whispered. They whispered. Powerful whispering campaign. There were a lot of us sitting around a table, and uh, after the actual episode was filmed, you asked me to say, uh, "Welcome to Educated Bowlers, Marshall's only uh, adult programming or something." I remember that because I felt so honored that you'd done that. Why don't you say it again now for a little pause here? Okay, go ahead. Welcome to Educated Bowlers, Marshall's only adult television program. Now you fucked it.